Hey, what's up, guys? We're hanging out in the Young Hollywood studio with Andy Serkis and Rohan Chan. Hey, guys. How's it going? How are you? I was just telling you guys how much I love this movie. It's insanely good. Oh, my gosh. Oh, good, thanks. And you shot it in South Africa, right? That we, must have been yeah, so we beautiful. Yeah, oh, it was an incredible place. We built the location for the village, which is the, 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 the last kind of act of the story it takes place in the human village. And they, they took ages they took ages and months to kind of grow plants and fit it into the jungle. They cut their way through it originally to, to, to actually build uh, huts and things. There were lots of snakes, weren't there? Yes, yeah. There were oh my God, were you terrified? Snakes. Yeah, I mean, I'm walking around with bare feet and everything too, yeah. so it's all that's yeah, exciting. Yeah. Your poor thing. Yeah, yeah. I you're mean, just in a little tunic. <laughs> Nothing can bite you anywhere. I mean, there, I think we caught over 80 or something snakes, and there were monkeys and things stealing props from the set, so that was that was always exciting. So. Oh, are you serious? That's yes, so funny. yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you you were so passionate about this film. Why is that? Were you a fan of the books? Is that yeah. why you were so passionate about this film? Yeah, and also, I mean, I, you know, I, I don't think people really were familiar with the books and the and the sort of the tone of the book. And everyone, we, we all grew up, I and mean, we all mm. grew up, didn't we, with the 1967 animation? But there is a much more kind of uh, complex journey of this young boy played by uh, Rowan Beauty. Beautifully, uh, Mowgli, um, and his journey to self-discovery, and this sense of him being other, this sense of him being outside, and uh, having to really work to. to see what world he's happiest in, whether it's the world of animals or man. And uh, yeah. it, it really, it, apart from anything else, I think this is a really emotional telling of that story. I am not a man, but neither am I a wolf. Which of you will follow me? Man come. The whole jungle has been watching you. Yeah, I like that it wasn't a, it's not a sing-along, it's not about the animals, it's it's so real, yeah. it's frightening, it's emotional, I love it. Um, you did such a great job in it. Oh, thanks. How thank did you guys get connected? Did you audition, or did you find him? How did it, how did you guys get connected for this movie? We have an amazing casting director on this movie, and uh, it was Lucy Bevan who suggested that I look at Roan, and I'd already seen him in this film, which was called Lone Survivor, Mark Wahlberg's film. Yeah, very he good. He played thank this great character at the end with this Afghani child with a duck, I seem to remember. <laughs> Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then we met via Skype, and we just immediately I saw him. I just thought, this is this is Mowgli. This is that we look no further. Now I read you actually slept with wolves to get into character. Yes, yeah, so I actually went to upstate New York in order to kind of observe the wolves without you know human interference and everything, and how the wolf interacts like within the wolf pack, like alpha to omega stuff like that. You know. It was just amazing to be able to like see that and incorporate that into Mowgli. What about the ladies? Do you have any Hollywood crushes yet? Are you giving him any advice dating wise? Oh, no, I'd be hoping to get. Um, but but have, I, have I ever given you any advice in that department? Not too much. No. <laughs> <laughs> any Hollywood crushes or anything like that? They're probably like, oh my god, it's you, you play Mowgli. Uh, no, not so much. I don't think. I mean, you know, I guess I'm yet, more. Yet. Yet. <laughs> yet. Yet. I guess yeah. I'm a bit more focused on the work. What's it like working with all these other characters in the movie? Kate Blanchett, I mean, so many great actors in this movie. Was that fun too, to work with them? Yeah, it was, it was really great. I mean, just the amount of commitment and the amount of hard work they really just put into their roles is really fantastic. Yeah, we were blessed. We had the most amazing cast. I know, yeah. I mean, and, they, and they're all using this uh, you know, performance capture technology to bring their performances to life. So it meant yeah. that Rowan could act absolutely in the same space with them. And, one of the things that we really wanted to do this movie was make those emotional connections between Mowgli and, and the animals feel very real and you know and, and heartbreaking at times and, and and I think that's you know mm -hmm. using that technology we were certainly able to do. Oh, that. it did the baby cub that's like you're my best friend Mowgli. I'm like oh my god. Oh yeah, that was, <laughs> that, that, was actually, in my... that was Andy's son who played that's, that. That is so, my son. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god, he's so good. <laughs> that was so good. How do you choose an actor to play a certain animal? How did you know Kate Blanchett would be good as a python? You, you, you really, when you're casting it, you start to think about the, the persona, the animal persona of it that a person might give off, you know, or, or a, not that I'm saying Kate's like a snake, but <laughs> all of the actors were cast because you just, you just heard their voices in the character and then thought, but actually physically they would be amazing because they would bring something uh, very special to it. Okay, before we end the segment, because you're so good at this, deciding what actor's good in an animal character, I'm just gonna throw some celebrity names out at you guys. Don't even think about it, just say which animal you think they could play. Don't okay. even hesitate, let's okay. just go for it. Selena Gomez, Ostrich. go. Ostrich? Ostrich? <laughs> uh, gi giraffe, I guess. Giraffe, okay. Um, Harry Styles, go for it. And um, um, Sloth? Sloth? I was gonna say some sort of bird. A bird? <laughs> Emma Stone, go. Um, magpie? Cheetah. 
<laughs> okay, last one and make it count. Justin Bieber. From um, <laughs> Baby Orangutan. <laughs> Baby Orangutan. <laughs> That's amazing. You guys, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. <laughs>